With a vote and a debate, TTIP, the transatlantic trade deal, had top billing in Strasbourg. But its big premier bit the dust. Millionen von Menschen warten darauf, was wir heute machen, und sie schieben es einfach beiseite. We are not voting today. Q chaos in the chamber. Please stand up. But was this democracy in motion amongst all the commotion, or were politicians running scared? Of course, I'm not totally satisfied with the development, but it was a real danger to have a fail. And therefore, I think the decision by the president was right. Late on Tuesday, President Martin Schulz decided to send the report back to the Trade Committee, cancelling the vote. C'est un Parlement qui a peur de la démocratie parce qu'il a peur que la démocratie remette en cause le projet transatlantique. But those in favor of seeing TTIP progress were simply baffled. The Greens are very much pushing the socialists. You saw today the Green chairman Rebecca Harms. She got applause from her group, from the Greens, and then from the right populists and from the left populists. And for the Liberals, the disorder showed one thing the division within the socialist group. The chairman of the trade committee himself, who, who started to amend the text that we had agreed with him personally as the rapporteur. Can MEPs find a way out for the parliament? And what about private arbitration under TTIP, the Investor State Dispute Mechanism, or ISDS? Private ISDS arbitration is dead. So it would seem more battles are yet to come. <laughs> Thank you.